The Ole Miss soccer team is heading back to the NCAA tournament for the second year in a row and the third time in the last four seasons. Ole Miss won three of their final four matches on the season. At 12-7-1, Ole Miss is one of nine SEC teams to make the dance. The Rebs are excited for a chance to play in at least one more match this year and show the nation what they got. So excited for the, for the team and for our fans and, and for our program. You know, go back to back years and three of the last fours. Really exciting. I think um, you know, getting nine teams in the SEC and us being part of one of those nine teams is great and uh, just happy for the team that we continue to play with. It's just great knowing we have one more game. We have such a strong team and we knew that we, there was more to, you know, there's more to us, at, especially after the Arkansas um, loss um, that did not reflect the talent on this team. So we were really excited to, you know, get into the NCAA tournament. The Rebels are heading east with a Saturday night date with the Clemson Tigers in the first round. It's a rematch of the 2015 tournament where Ole Miss took down the Tigers on their home field, advancing to their first Sweet 16 in program history. I think Clemson's a great team. They, they've they been good all year. Um, you know, Eddie's a great coach. Uh, I have a lot of respect for them and their staff. And uh, we're going to have to be at our best to, to, to get, go there and, and try and get a result. I think, uh, you know, they're a strong team out of the ACC. They've had a very good year. And I think it's a really good matchup, one that will be, will be uh, really fun for our team to participate in. Um, I just think it, we showed what we, what we can do and what we're capable of, and so, you know, it gave us all so much confidence in each other. Just at, as a team, you know, I feel like we're really confident going into this game. Make sure you keep up with the Rebs on social media as well as OleMissSports.com as this team looks to make a run here in 2018.